What's up everybody, this is Daxon here at Weaver Family Farm. So I wanted to make this quick video of this. What is going on here? Um, show you, see how there's lines, squiggly space, and I was kind of messing around. I was trying to take some of it out last night, but uh, I have to use it sand to be able to redo this board. And you can see it just a little bit up here. Um, and I messaged uh, Zach's the creator of T2 Laser, asked him, hey, he's like, hey, what's going on? He's always good about answering my questions. If you don't have T2 um, Laser Engraver software, I highly recommend it. It is amazing, and um, it's endless what all you can do with it. But anyway, he said this is called Backlash, and I was like, all right, you know what causes that? Let me head on over here to my machine, and you can see, let me turn on my... And you can see this one turned out perfect, excellent. Um, so what the, what the backlash comes from is loose parts. Now what I would did is made sure everything was tight, and then I started coming across um, like these bolts right here, but mostly the ones where the wheels are, these and these. Some of the bolts are actually almost to actually come out. I mean, it was so loose. So I had to go through and make sure all these were really nice and tight. And same way with these right here, um, that go on the uh, metal beam right here. Make sure that, you know, those are pushed up and then tightened really good. Same way at the other side. And that did solve my problem. Also something else, if your guys' machine is shaking and you got a desk like this and you don't mind uh, doing a little bit of stuff with like a Dremel tool, you see right here, I put little notches. So this sets down and then this can't move when it's um, engraving. So I've had really good luck doing that. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. You can see, once again, I'll show you that one looks great after I tighten everything. And you can see what these lines were doing. Once again, it's called backlash, and uh, that's how you fix it. And also, sometimes uh, the belt, I was told, you might need to tighten your belts if they get loose. That could also cause the problem. But thanks for watching. See you later. Bye-bye.